to hear. Yeah, it's going to really heat up this weekend. 601 new this morning. A more than $200 million construction project at the Illinois Veterans Home will provide new living facilities and a dining hall. Yeah, work on those facilities was expected to be completed by the end of April, but delays have pushed back that opening. WGM's Ryan Hill joins us with an updated timeline for the project. Good morning, Ryan. Good morning. Now, I spoke with the administrator, says construction is a little behind, but they are nearly finished. Chuck Newton says they are 80 to 85 percent done with construction, and the project began in 2018 with the demolition of the old facilities. He says supply chain issues have made it difficult to get building material, which had caused delays. He says they have a new set date to open the facilities. I think we'll see the domiciliary residents move sometime later this year. Um, the kitchen, laundry, pharmacy, those spaces will be ready for occupancy, let's say sometime possibly in July, August. Newton says the project should still remain on budget, and he says the improvements will benefit veterans, as the living facilities will have their own shower and washroom for residents. He says it will make it much easier for veterans and give them their own space. Now, coming up in the next half hour, we'll have more on what work still needs to be done before they open up. Back to you, Andy. Thank you, Ryan. Newton says before they fully open up, they will have to go through the certification and inspection process to make sure everything is up to code and in working order. New this